Let's do this. That is ridiculous. I mean, oh, happy birthday to you. Love the ball. In person, love it up in the green. Go to love people. Be your love. This gentleman is surprising his wife with a watch. We are at the lovely George's Hill today. Uh, mining cow's birthday gift from Judd. Beautiful course. We're on the third hole, par three. Judd's about to tee off. Cut. About. Oh. Ah. Beautiful, beautiful course. Lovely and green. But I feel so much fresher. The bods not on us just yet, but you know they're coming. And uh cool, we'll the pressure on the first hour working. <laughs> Lovely occasion today. I'm sporting the in stock rose gold date at 40 with a chocolate Roman numeral dial available, box and papers 216, 33, and then a five. You've got to, you've got to wear the Prezi with it in the presidential club. Which green? Love you, Mikey. Sound like a god today. Let's do this. Cows putting tricks, part one. <laughs> lovely, lovely, <laughs> lovely golf fur uh, course. I don't know. Something lovely the guy good. told us at the start, it's a very fast green. So far, I don't think I've done anything less than a free putt. <laughs> <laughs> well right in it. Yeah. That's on the road. Crab! Can't see you in jail. My second molly. <laughs> nice. Right down the middle. We're on the hole 15 of the back nine. I've had a great back nine so far. We're on a par five currently. Cal's about to hit the ball. Mm. Mm. Pleasurous. Mm. <laughs> Dark shit. <laughs> Straight down the mill! <laughs> Straight down the mill! Probably the best tee off I've ever done. Man. Me and DJ Cullen shared that same tee shot. Oh, what a beast. Still can't even see it. You see, go. Al going to take drops apparently. <laughs> <laughs> 18, 18 hills it was, 18 holes. Oh my god, that is every the hole was a hill. Of this golf every every hole was a hill, they weren't flat one, flat hole. It was good though, my back nine was a lot better. Tough. Six. Happy 30th, lads. <laughs> That's what I want to say about Six. that. Seven. It was actually so Five. much harder than I thought. Seven. I come in here today feeling pretty confident. We've got a team, we've got a team there grinding it out whilst we grind out the golf. It's only fair. But yeah, they're doing well. I can see by the app. It's pinging off with sales, and we're slowly cracking away. I didn't mind the boys going to play golf on company time because I feel like everyone needs a day off every now and then. I had three days off the day prior, so if I was in a position I can't mow, 
but they had a great time. We still got shit done here, so it was an all round thumbs up from me. It was nice to have a day of no one farting, no one leaving their lunch on the table, no one saying, we've got any waters in there, not checking the fridge. No one asking me, Tiddy, where's this? Where's that? Where's the tape? It was a great day. <laughs> I feel like I actually feel like a cataract. Oh, buying too much stock. I'm stressing you. I don't have had a rub. My eyes aren't even working. They don't even help. Oh, God. Staring at screens. Oh, yeah, guys. Drop in the comments. It's Callum and Alex's 30th this week. That's why I'm shattered. See golfing yesterday. Team held it down well. Straight down the middle! If you want to wish them both a happy birthday, a happy 30th birthday, it'd be very kind of you to drop a little comment in the section. And don't go on like you're watching it on the TV. You can still go on your phone, do a little happy birthday. It means a lot. The <laughs> the, right, I'm going to put the email here, info at Trotter's Jewelers. Send in the best birthday messages you can on video. And the best ones, I'll send you a free care package. Hat, watch roll. It's your birthday. I know, but I want some people to send, say happy birthday to me. Any delivery coupons, do a little Alex code. <laughs> what, what am I, like, what is, what is this like, what is life? I'm 30 years old now. <laughs> That's like, it's actually dis disgusting. I've got a pair of Calvin Klein pants and Nike socks. Mate, I thought you're fucking lucky. I've got a pack of three Calvin Klein pants. You're lucky. How many socks? 32 to 34 waist. Your pants are disgusting. <laughs> I feel like so disheartened today. Happy birthday to you. Gee. It's okay. My turn. No, they don't want to explode. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Cameron and Alex. Happy birthday to you. Hey! Hope you both made a wish. I'm a moose. What so is this a is this, is this, is this a white face, right? Or so my so 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 exact same models in yeah. terms of shape, dial, yeah. etc. Just the years is the difference. Okay. So the years are what you're paying for, right, right, right. in essence. I say on average for like a, a per year on a day date. Yeah. Around like 700 quid usually per year okay. extra you pay. So 218 I can do for 2905. Yeah. Uh, and in the 2020, it's an extra grand. It's about 500 quid extra per year. But that's just up to you. I mean, you go for, yeah, go, they, they're the same watch in terms of like visual, in terms of the dial. There's no different, no different shape, size, anything like that. It's just a year. So that's nice. 5167. Yeah. What'd you um, pay? Cheap? You why, uh, got it for 38. Oh, nice. So I was just saying, yeah, yeah, my, like my boss was selling it, had it on Chrono for like 42, 750, and just sold it to me direct. So yeah, nice. Really good, mate. The olive, yeah. I haven't got the, what, the yellow green? Yeah, yeah. I've yeah. got that. That's It's not class as the olive. The olive's usually the rose uh, day day yeah, yeah, yeah. or the white one. But yeah, I've got the green. If you want to have a look yeah, yeah, at it. Try it. Yeah, so this is actually sold. But yeah, I mean, that's yeah, the one. Nice to try that. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. Nice. But a massive premium for, yeah, for, the, for the green dial, though. How much did this one go for? Uh, that, was a, that was a 2022. Yeah. 47.5 we sold yeah. that. Blue blue dials and green dials tend to be like yeah, premium sort of dials. Um, that's that's very different to the olive though. Sold this over the weekend, 2022, 47.5. Love the dial in person, it's lovely. I think the green goes lovely with the yellow. Slightly different to the rose olive and the white olive. Don't actually class this as an olive, but it, however, is lovely with the yellow. Do you have this in, in a white like this as well? I don't have the white Roman. I don't have in stock. I, I mean, if it was something you was after, I could certainly find it for you. It's not a problem. It's bit. I'll be honest, yeah. It's unusual. The, the, usually the white. Sorry. The silver. Usually the, yeah, the silver is the. So this is more sort. Of ah, like massively. Yeah. The, in the in the in the yellow, I'd say the the silver dial is probably the best. Other than like 
the green and the diamond yeah. one and stuff. The silver Roman is usually the, the one that people want. Right, okay. White Roman is probably like the least popular in the, in the yellow and the rose. Okay, yeah, yeah. But listen, if you if it was yeah, yeah, well, I'm still if it was the white you was you was after and you liked, <laughs> then by all means go for it. Um, Alex, thanks, mate. Really appreciate it. Yeah, listen, you want to try it or make sure. I mean, yeah. at least you, at least you know the sh you like the shape. Yeah, mate, I now I would say the decision is to make sure you go for the right dial. Yeah. You got my WhatsApp awesome. now, so really appreciate just drop that, me a message. Thank you so we'll much. Really yeah. appreciate it. Nice. Thank you. Cheers, guys. Thank Cheers. You. Thank you. Just Shane Jewell, uh, who's a good friend of a friend of a friend, JD and Cal Kennedy. Shout out to you guys. Uh, no, George knows them boys. Uh, they all work together, so appreciate them uh, putting different clients onto us. That was George. Was after a day date forty yellow toss up between the silver Roman or the white Roman. If you guys comment below, let us know what you would go for: silver Roman numeral or white Roman numeral. Um, yeah, said if he's gonna have a think about it, might potentially come back in on Monday to, to pick the silver up. I've just said, look, pick the one that you wanna go for, make sure you try a white on first. So hopefully we see him probably Monday to purchase the silver one. This gentleman is surprising his wife with a watch. I've got the watch inside. It's a stainless steel 26 mil with a silver diamond dial. She'll be very happy, so we can't wait to see. Thank you. Oh my god, thank you. You're really gonna look at it. This is really embarrassing. Oh, that's so nice. Thank you. Stainless steel 26mm, diamond dial. Beautiful watch. So, on Tuesday, they uh, got involved in our competition. At Beautiful Fun Days, I went congratulations, you're the winner of the free Rolex watch. Congratulations. So they'll have to obviously come and collect. So we've let them notify. I'll take a photo now. On... Do, you they're, they're, do you reckon they're watching live or do you reckon somebody's already messaged them to say you've won it? See so what they won. The still and gold Rolex date just 36 mil. Factory diamond dial, complete with box and paperwork. Guys, if you think this is a good giveaway and you think we've done something good for the business, let us know in the comments below. If you'd like to see us do another giveaway, also comment below and tell us what you would like us to give away next. We're thinking about it, as long as it helps the business and it helps us grow socially, we're up for the challenge. I mean, we've get, we've, last year, our last giveaway, we actually gave away 15,000 pounds of stuff. We've done the same watch, with a matching women's watch with 26 mil. We done two Louis Vuitton bags, a 500 pound selfie voucher, and a case of Bel Air champagne. That's our biggest one so far. Who knows? Oh, nice. You like it? I love it. So another serious piece going out today to Lagos. We've got the diamond Cartier Santos with the rose gold bezel and the white stainless steel bits on the side. Sold. Sold. <laughs> sold to Great Yarmouth. <laughs> Third Hulk sold in like two weeks, I think. Two weeks. We don't, we, don't, we don't get a massive demand for the 28th, if you to be honest. Because we find that the, the happy medium budget is like probably a, third, a 26 to a 31, be that four and a half to like six and a half. Because yeah. 28s, they do jump up, to be fair. That's why they're sort of valued a bit more higher. So, mm. so for a 31 uh, price, you can get a 36. So you should bear that in mind oh, as well. Really? Yeah, yeah, you can. Yeah, and the 31 mil, yeah, there's definitely less about. We get loads of the 26s. We actually struggled to get the 31s. But at the end of the day, it's like, what, it's whatever you're comfortable with and whatever you put on your wrist, and you go, you know what, that's the right side. Yeah. That fits good, it feels nice. Diamond dial's a 6650. Yeah. yeah, we don't want the diamonds. And then plain dial be like 6.5. That's a concealed 36, that's a classic 36. What does that mean? So this is a classic buckle, come out, come out in like 1988, oh. um, up until 2006. Then 2006, they went concealed up until 2016. In 2016 to now, they've got the upgraded buckle with the uh, new box clasp on it. So basically the new buckle looks similar to this again, which okay. is upgraded. Um, so you typically pay like 6 4 50 for a 36 classic, yeah. and then that's concealed, so you'll pay around 8 5 for one of these. Oh my God. Okay. Yeah. Just from that, all the changing? Yeah, it's not, it's, it's obviously, it's, it's, a, it's a solid case, yeah. polished shoulders, and solid bracelet, concealed, and that's a 2012. And what car watches do you have? No, but I've got a couple of tanks, maybe some like leather references, like a Midi Santos, Basculante, got a Dumont Cinema Rose. Oh, really? Oh, Have you got one of them at home? It's lovely, watch that. Still on Rose Gold, 
factory mother pearl doll. It's a 2013 in like new condition. Look how sharp that is. The thing is that they said that Cartier you don't really kind of depreciates. So they're cheaper than Rolex. Yeah. Then in the pre in the pre market, you're already paying cheap for it anyway. So how much can you really devalue by it? You're not going to lose like 50 percent on, on a car, eh? It's just like you're. I think you're in the same sort of bracket, if I'm honest. Yeah. That would hold its value better than that, though, wouldn't it? I think. I think all, all these here will, will all hold similar money, give or take 20, 25 percent. Yeah. Because you're not paying ridiculously no. like this. This in Cartier today, that would probably be like way more. Yeah. Yeah. How, much, how much is that? That's four thousand. That is nice. And that is value. Mm. And this is not like a new condition. And it's definitely not too in your face either. It's probably going to creep up to six, six and a half, I guess. I'd go like thirty-one mil if I was you. Thirty-one mil, six and a half grand. And you went to white Roman emerald dial, didn't you? There's no negotiation on price. I mean, not nothing's going to go like. It's not like grand's off, it's 100 quid's off. You're lucky to get a couple hundred quid. Because mm -hmm. we, we price to sell, and we all this our stock, all your stock sort of refreshes yeah, every no. sort of three weeks, no, you know, so. What should you do, should you have that one? 100%? So we finally got a decision. Stainless steel and yellow gold. Just 36 mil with the white batten dial. Very clean. Closest you could get to this. Well, that one, like Cartier, if you like Cartier, that's bussy. Closer you could get to that. Normally, I just go for the plain Jane from the Rolex. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. I'm trying to make a bit different. I love a Cartier. I've been at 13 five. That's a, I think that's a lovely Cartier, to be fair. If you want to mix up a little bit. More of a, more of a AP but, rolling now. Really, yeah. yeah. <laughs> fair enough. Fair yes. enough. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a go-to Rolex guy, but try yes. it on. The new shapes that they, they feel. They're unbelievable, to be fair. So if you're an AP man, offshore, try on. It's a city, it's a the stones on that are quite big, I can't Yeah, they are. <laughs> they are very large. Very oversized. How much is that? How much is that one? Uh, that's 42. It's not bad. Or you got day date, 39 out of five. Look at that dial there, to be fair. The Tahitian, I think Tahitian probably beats it, to be honest. You like that one? Yeah, and value, it's half price. Oh, do you manage? He does. Father yeah. and son? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't do like COD YouTube, so do you know Lando Norris? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got like a like a gaming team, so we right. do like content like that. So we'll do like go-kart racing each other. Oh, really? Yeah. That's good. You do what, that on simulators and stuff? Uh, oh. We've got like go-karts, like proper. Oh, wow. Yeah, so we do that on YouTube. What a plane got a rose gold one of um, Mika Richards from Man City. He bought it in heyday, mm. like when he was young. He must give like cheap for it, to be fair. And uh, we bought it off him in a part exchange because he said oh, I haven't worn this in like 15 years. It's sitting in my safe, just never worn it. 1.25 kilo, that's a, that's no clasp, so it's, it's <laughs> on off, on off. Just all built, it's all built together. So it's like you can't, you can't break. It won't break. 18 karat, solid. That's ridiculous. And uh, can't, and, you know, I couldn't tell it. Just couldn't. It's just way too much. Just way, it's just built. It's just like you can't sell things like that. It's like you couldn't unset it because it's just you'd lose too much on what you on the drilling. And then yeah. cost too much to sell it, so then I was end up scrapping it. From what I give him the pike exchange, the gold went high, and I scrapped it. I scrapped it for like fucking forty grand or something like that. It's like man, that's what I mean. Though you can't get a chain like that. Cause you, where are you gonna wear it? The other person pulled a few strings, got that dial sorted. Lovely blue sapphire dial. Thank you very I much. It's much better than this. More class. Thank you. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. That is ridiculous. Oh, that I mean, yeah. you, you get that. Nice. See how it change, change the whole look? Yeah, that is. I mean, it's normally, normally we, we give two, two days to people on the dark swaps. I like a little. So look, I mean, yeah, no, I like the blue. Just the blue just breaks yeah, up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, that's what that's what nice. that's what I'm saying. Yeah. This style looks so much better. Nah, that's so sick. Thank yeah. you very much. Let's go, man. Yeah, no, that is so sick. I'm gassed. Yeah, it's a good trade to have. That's oh, cool. yeah, that is ridiculous. Nah, Man's gonna be staring at his wrist. <laughs> <laughs> just constantly. Nah, no, no. It's just every time. It's one of them where it's like you'll be sat somewhere with good lighting, then it'll start twinkling, yeah, yeah, and you're just sat there like. If you go somewhere in the evening, yeah. you're around a spotlight or something, that's a dash at that. Just watch it start twinkling. Yeah. That's so sick, man. Yeah. I love Quite the blue as well, that is perfect. Nice. It's more modern, it's like nice. That is lovely, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, big thanks to uh, Eve for coming out to us today, thank you very much.
camera. You're out. So do you know, if the rough weren't that bad, no I'd comment. take a few more. But because oh, the no. rough is so bad, I would like normally say like, any mulligans is straight cheap. Like, that that would be rough? that would be for like a high handicapper for us. We're straight. If you hit in the rough, well, I don't. If you did, like, it might be bad. <laughs> I, I didn't take a mulligan, but if you did, it's so guaranteed. Oh, yeah. Really good. <laughs>